Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Bangladesh to get the latest videos on learning English, IELTS, TOEFL, GRE, GMAT, SAT, ELT, TESOL and Linguistics. This is Amir Lord, Chairman IELT and Head of Linguistics Baita Bangladesh, a more than 20 years experience IELTS trainer home and abroad and IELTS 8.5 band scorer with our IELTS 8 plus preparation training course part 5 IELTS speaking module. This is IELTS speaking module part 1 lecture 4. As a part of our online and on-ground IELTS teaching and training program, this lecture is on IELTS speaking part 1 exclusive suggestion 1. In this video, I will also discuss 15 most important familiar topics with probable and suggested questions for IELTS speaking module part 1. So, this video is very important and helpful for all kinds of IELTS candidates. Learn English, buy English, keep watching my English medium lecture videos to acquire English like a native. I maintain international standard in teaching English and IELTS. Let's get started. Introduction IELTS speaking module is a one-to-one oral test held between a candidate and an examiner that extends for 11 to 14 minutes and includes three parts. Part 1 of the IELTS speaking module is generally known as introduction and interview or personal and familiar issues where the examiner will usually ask 10 to 14 questions on four topics. Number one, about yourself. Number two, about your life. Number three, about your country. And number four, on a family topic. Among 10 to 14 short questions in our speaking part one, Four to six questions are asked on a common and known topic that is familiar to you. After being introduced to each other and confirming candidates and examiner's identifications, the examiner approaches to ask general questions on a familiar topic. Now, I am going to present 15 most important familiar topics with probable and suggested questions for our speaking module part 1 as exclusive suggestion 1. Let's go! 15 most important familiar topics with probable and suggested questions for our speaking module part 1 as exclusive suggestion 1 which are commonly given in our speaking test part 1. As speaking test part 1, family topic 1, study, probable suggestions as suggested questions are number 1, are you a student or a service holder? Question 2, what are you studying now? Question 3, how do you study before your examination? Question 4, what's your last educational qualification? Question 5. Why do you want to study abroad? Question 6. Do you enjoy studying? Question 7. What are your study interests? Question 8. Why is study important? Question 9. What are the problems of higher study in your country? As speaking test part 1, family topic 2, hometown. Probable suggested questions as Question 1. Where is your hometown? Question 2. Do you like your hometown? Why or why not? Question 3. What are the special things in your hometown? Question 4. How is local transport system in your hometown? Question 5. How is your hometown different from other cities? Question 6. 
Are you happy living in your hometown? Why or why not? Question 7. What changes do you find in the last 10 years in your hometown? Question 8. What changes will you expect in the next 10 years? I speaking test part 1, family topic 3, name. Probable questions suggested as question 1, what is the meaning of your name? Question 2, do you like to change your name? 3, do you think that your name bears or matches with your personality? Question 4, what traditions are followed to name a newly born baby in your country? Question 5. Why is name important for a man? Question 6. What are the most common names in your country? Question 7. What do first name, surname, and nickname mean? A speaking test part 1, family topic 4, work. Probable questions suggested as question 1. Do you work somewhere? Question 2. What type of job do you hold? Question 3. Do you enjoy your job? Question 4. How far is your office from your residence and how do you go there? Question 5. What problems do you face during your work? Question 6. What are the specialties of your job? Question 7. Please tell us about your workplace. A speaking test part 1, family topic 5, living place. Probable questions suggested as question 1. Do you live in a house or a flat? Question 2. Who do you live with? Question 3. How long have you been living there? Question 4. Do you plan to live there for a long time? Question 5. Can you describe the place where you live? Question 6. Which room does your family spend most of the time in? Question 7. What's the difference between where you are living now and where you have lived in the past? A speaking test part 1, family topic 6, accommodation. Probable questions suggested as question 1, what kind of housing or accommodation do you live in? Question 2, what do you usually do in your house, flat or room? 3, are, you, are the transport facilities to your home very good? 4. Do you prepare living in a house or a flat? 6. Please describe the room you live in. 6. 7. What part of your home do you like the most? 8. Do you think that accommodation is a great problem in your country? Question 8. Why is an accommodation very important for us? A speaking test one, part one, exclusive suggestion one, familiar topic seven, weather. Probable suggestions and suggested questions as question one, what's the weather like today? Question two, what kind of weather do you like best and why? Question three, what's your favorite weather and why? Question four, what do you usually do during your favorite weather or season? Question 5. How is the weather in your hometown? Question 6. Do you like that weather? Why and why not? Question 7. How often is the weather good in your hometown? Question 8. What did you do the last time the weather was good? Question 9. Are there any bad points about the weather in your city? A speaking part one, suggestion one, family topic eight, climate change. Question one, what do you mean by climate? How is it different from weather? Question two, 
what is the typical weather in your country like three have you been any change in the weather over the past few years seen four does the weather ever affect what you do question five how does the weather affect people question six how do you feel when the weather is cloudy question seven do you always pay attention to the weather forecast question eight can you give any examples of usual weather question nine do you like snow question ten would you prefer to live in a place that has just one warm season that lasts the whole year or a place with different seasons. A speaking test part one suggestion one family topic nine favorite season probable questions suggested as question one how many seasons do you have in your country question two what are the differences you find between two close seasons Three, which is your favorite season? Why? Question four, which of the seasons you dislike? Why? Five, which months make which season? Six, what specialties do you find in each season in your country? Question seven, why are seasons important for our life? A speaking test. Part 1, Suggestion 1, Family Topic 10, Punctuality. Probable questions suggested as Question 1, Do you think it's important to be on time? Question 2, How do you feel when others are late? 3, Are you yourself late very often? Question 4, How do you feel when you are late? Question 5, how do you think you could be on time? Question 6. Do you wear a watch? Question 7. If you go back in time, what would you do differently? Question 8. When does time seem to move fast and when does it seem to move slowly? A speaking test part 1. Suggestion 1, family topic 11, social media. Probable question suggested as question 1, do you follow social media? Question 2, which is your most favorite social media? Question 3, which other social media do you follow? Question 4, why do people follow social media? Question 5, why do you think social media is important for us? Question 6, how do social media influence our lives and society? Question 7. What are the threats of our social media? Question 8. Discuss the merits and demerits of social media. A speaking test part 1 suggestion 1 family topic 12. Television. Probable questions suggested as question 1. How much do you usually watch TV? Question 2. What's your favorite TV program? 3. Did you watch TV much when you were a child? How much? 4. What types of programs did you watch when you were a child? 5. Do you think television has changed in the past few decades? 6. Possibly, do you think television has changed since you were a child? Question 7. Has television changed your life in any way? Question 8. Discuss the merits and demerits of watching television. A speaking part 1, suggestion 1, family topic 13, favorite TV program. Probable questions. Question 1. Which TV program is your most favorite? Question 2. Do you watch your favorite TV program regularly? Question 3. When is it telecasted and one year in a day? Question 4. What types of program is it? Question 5. What is the specialties in this TV program? Question 6. 
Do you think that a TV program can influence people? Question seven. Why should we watch some special TV programs regularly? As speaking test part one, suggestion one, family topic 14, website. Probable questions suggested as question one. Which is your most favorite website? Question two. Do you browse it? Every day, and when do you browse it most? Question three: How is it different from other websites? Question four: What are the major features of the site? Question five: Why is it special to you? Question six: Describe the main features and traits of your favorite website. As speaking test part one, suggestion one, family topic fifteen. Holidays or public holidays? Probable questions suggested as question one. What public holidays do you have in your country? Question two. Do people in your country celebrate public holidays with pomp and grandeur? Question three. Do you like public holidays? Question four. Which public holidays do you like the most? Question 5. What did you do during the last public holiday? Question C. What do other people in your country usually do on public holidays? Question 7. What would you like to do during the next public holiday? Question 8. Do you think public holidays are important? Question 9. Do you think there should be more public holidays in your country. Question 10. Do you think that your government should celebrate all the public holidays nationwide? Conclusion. Dear candidates, don't try to memorize answers of the suggested questions. Try to make answers as your own in two to three sentences. Always keep in mind the following four scoring skills and parameters and criteria in IELTS speaking test during your practicing. Number one, fluency and coherence of presentation. Number two, lexical resource and standard of vocabulary. Number three, pronunciation and accentuation accuracy. Number four, grammatical range and accuracy. The words, that is the end of our speaking test part one, exclusive suggestion one. In my I'll speaking series lecture five, I will talk about our speaking test part one, suggestion two. To get nine band model answers of the above suggested topics and questions, please subscribe by the Bangladesh channel and stay connected with us. Thank you.